On the night of January 22, 1997, Lottie Williams of Tulsa, Oklahoma, experiences a once-in-a-lifetime event. While walking through a park, she observes a bright flash in the sky resembling a meteor, only to be struck moments later by a piece of falling space debris. Williams is hit on the shoulder by a small, six-inch long piece of metal, thought to be from a disintegrated Delta Air rocket. NASA confirms the timing and location aligned with the re-entry of the rocket's second stage, with main wreckage found in Texas. The rarity of such an event highlights the vastness of space and the effectiveness of safety measures. Space agencies work diligently to predict re-entry paths, focusing on minimizing risks by directing debris towards unpopulated areas or large water bodies. Williams' story echoes the famed Skylab incident, where debris from the first U.S. space station rained down over Australia in 1979. Such occurrences underline the challenges in predicting the exact landing of space junk. Considering the increasing amount of space debris, what steps can be taken to ensure safer skies above us, and how might future space missions mitigate the risks associated with returning debris? Share your thoughts below.